Hey guys, it's Five Tool Breaks. Uh, today we're going to be doing some basketball. We're going to go Zion or jaw hunting. Um, hopefully we can pull something pretty big. Um, if not, it is what it is. Uh, this is one of the uh, retail boxes. Come with only uh, 24 packs, four cards per pack. Um, pick this up from our local card shop. Um, these have gotten quite high. They're hard to find now. Um, so we're going to see if we can uh, get something decent out of here. Alright, a little stand prop. Let's get to cracking. Gonna pull right off the top, left to right. See if we get something decent. All right, we got Danny Green. Sorry for the glare. We're still working with what we got. We'll make some adjustments. Green Larry Bird. It's pretty cool. Rookie Cody Martin. Stash all these and separate them down below the camera view. I hate prism packs trying to open them. I don't want to bend the cards, but I also want to get them out. Let's see. We've got uh, Dennis Robin, that's pretty cool. Markel Foltz. A dominance Luca. Pretty cool. We'll set that to the side. Lucas sells well, no matter what card it is. Anthony Davis to end it. The struggle. The struggle is real. Nikola Djokic. It's one more. Ooh, silver rookie of uh, Tremont Waters. I uh, don't know too much about basketball. I really don't pay too much attention to it, with the exception of you know the bigger names and what you hear on Sports Center. Um, let me know in the comments if this guy's uh, pretty good or not. We're gonna go ahead and sleep him up. Put them in the Ultra Pro. Sit him in front of my 24 karat gold Javi Lopez. Got me back there in the view. So that's a pretty good start getting a silver rookie. I mean, within the first few packs, I got something good signs to come. Oh my gosh, if this is going to be the whole video like this. Ugh. Oh, I see Tyler Hero on the bottom, so ruin that surprise. Really good rookie from what I hear. Uh, Marcus Smart. Bogdan Bogdanovich. Oh, ooh, there we go. Always like seeing some color rookies right there. Jordan Poole. And then a Tyler Hero base. Let's take Tyler Hero. We're going to put a sleeve on him just because I know. I don't know what these are number two or not. Oh, that's not. Still, that's got to be a good card. Has to be. Especially playing for Golden State. That's really, really cool. Whoops, I broke the camera. Sorry. If y'all could see the rigging I did to rig up my phone because I've got tired of fooling with my camera to get it set up, you would probably probably bust out laughing. I'm talking cardboard and that painter's tape that you saw in the beginning. Oh, it's it's hilarious. I might put a behind the scenes shot here at the end. You're just gonna be like, oh my God. <laughs> Amateurs. Put that over my Chipper Jones gallery card. Cause that's sweet. Come 
Come on. Hey, there we go. Let's see if I can hide the rookie so you can't see it and get all that, the surprise ruined. All right, we got uh, Zach Levine. Oops, messed that up. Joseph Nurkic. Silver Mike Conley. And then we got Eric Bashal, rookie. Oh yeah, I forgot to sleeve up Tyler Hero. Hero, Hero. I'm not sure which. I'm not gonna put him in a card saver. Or play card saver yet. I might at the end of the, after the video is over. Got a Carl Malone. Kevin Knox. Saku Dumbuya. Heard he's doing pretty good too. A little instant impact card. And then a Trevor Ariza. So we do a little bit of multi-sport stuff. Uh, it's mainly really going to be baseball um, for the vast majority. We'll do prism. We might be able to get some optic, optic if we can find some for basketball, but it's been scarce, hard to find. Um, same thing with the with the prism. This is the last last box that we could find um, anywhere. So from now on, it's probably going to be the majority of baseball. Um, with maybe a little football thrown in, depending on what we can find. There's a few things at the LCS that we might get that we could probably get for a good price. Um, but let's get back to the, the prism. So maybe we could pull up a, a colored uh, Zion, maybe like that, or maybe a silver Zion. I'd probably freak out. Probably hear my dog in the background. Nails on the hardwood floor. Sorry about that. Kobe White. Stick him in the little rookie pile. Thaddeus Young. Let's see who else we got here. Uh, I got a Gordon Hayward. Willie Cauley Stein. Sorry about that glare. Ooh, Silver Sakuna Booyah. And then a rookie Jalen Hands. Let's sleeve that up. So apparently, um, I've been sending cards in to get graded for a while now, and I did not know that PSA prefers these type of loaders, if you will, top loaders. It's just the Ultra Pro Card Saver ones. They, uh, I don't know why they prefer them over the the standard top loader. I, I couldn't tell you why. I mean, to me, I feel like these are more protective of the corners than these. But to each their own, I guess. I could be wrong on that. There could be some thought process behind it that I may not know about. If you know, let me know in the comments. Because I'd like to learn about it if there's a reason. Uh, Mikhail Bridges, or Michael Bridges, I probably just mispronounced that whole zero. Um, Bradley Beal, Green Derrick Rose, and then a Bob Dodge. Gilchrist. Sorry for the glare. I know it's probably rough that light. Oh lord, the phone. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. <laughs> the phone literally came loose. The tape fell. That was uh that was bad. That was really bad. Alright, back, back to the card opening. Oh lord, I gotta get something done about that. That was awful. You'll see a slight edit. Alright, uh, Kelly Olnix, 
We got uh, Stephen Curry, hyped. Got a Kevin Porter Jr. rookie. Okay. Hope that doesn't happen again for the videos of whether you'll never see this video. It'll be buried. Nicholas Batum, Josh Richardson, Silver Wendell Carter Jr., and a KZ Opala rookie. Gotta hit something decent to help pay for this box because it was not cheap. Not at all. You need a big card, you need a big card, big money, no wins. Which I don't know. I mean, maybe one of them to pan out to at least counteract some of it. I doubt either one would really pay for the box. I highly doubt. Uh, let's do Sean Kemp here. Kevin Looney. A uh, silver Yao Ming. Pretty cool. And Eric Bledsoe. Stephen Curry Dominance and a Carson Edwards rookie. Larry Johnson, Quinn Cook, a little color Rudy Gobert. Some, some color like that of LeBron, you're into some, some change right there. I think I sold a silver LeBron from prison back early when it first came out, like seventy-five dollars. It was that was a nice little bit for a nine-dollar pack. And I got some Tristan Thompson, Joshua Kigi, uh, Hakeem Elijah Warren, pretty cool. And then a Darius Basley rookie. We're getting a lot of rookies, of course, just not the two big stars that we're looking for. All right, Larry Nance Jr., Alfonso McKinney. There we go, that's cool. And Green Kobe White, and a Paul Gasol. I'm gonna put a sleeve on this one. I hear Kobe's pretty good. I haven't paid or seen any, pretty much anything for him. Just what I've heard from a few people. Stick that. I mean, I'm actually gonna put it in the card set just because I don't know if it's gonna be worth anything. I'd rather rather sleeve it and find out later. And if it's not worth nothing, I'll just leave it in the sleeve and take it out of the card set and use the card set for something else. It's gotta be a Gotta be money conscious here, you know. Can't be wasting card savers and stuff. You know, you know, like 25 cents a piece. It adds up after a while. You start blowing them on dollar cards. All right, Isaiah Thomas, Donovan Mitchell, a green Hassan Whiteside, and a Matisse Thibel or Thibuli. However you say that. Marvin Bagley the third, and an RJ Barrett emergent, and uh, Nikola Vucevic or Vukovic. Let's see how many packs we got here. Ooh, we ain't got very many left. Six packs left. Not much at all.
Oh, oh, I see Zion on the bottom. Oh, I wrote that one, so we better just go ahead and look at it. Please be well centered. Eh, it's not awful on the centering, not the, the greatest, but still it's Zion. I mean, the surface looks really good for having that over. Oh, that's just dust. Yeah, surface looks really good. Pretty happy with that. So the Zion hunt is successful. Maybe see if we can get that graded. I doubt the centering will get us a BGS nine and a half. Might get us a nine, but the rest of it might make it gem out. And that's still over a hundred and twenty, hundred and fifty dollar car. Maybe touching two hundred, depending on how the rest of the season goes. I mean, it could be more than that. I've got one cent off of BGS right now that looked perfect. So I'm waiting to get it back. So we'll see, but hey, that's oh, don't mess it up. That's awesome. I'm glad we I'm glad we found one on the video that makes that makes the video well worth it when you actually pull what you're looking for. Now let's see if we can get Ja or some color of one of these two guys. I'm gonna put that for my Desert Shield chipper. There's this box. Let's see what the rest of this pack had. Got uh, Tory Craig, Shea Gilgis Alexander, and then a silver DJ Augustine. Got a Dennis Smith Jr. Uh oh, here we go. What we got here? Oh, it's Harry Smith. We got a Dan Izzle Auto. No idea who this guy is, not gonna lie. This can't be current. Can it? I don't know. That name doesn't ring a bell at all. Like I said, don't pay attention to basketball, so feel free to destroy me in the comments if this guy's like somebody I should know. I have no idea. I'm going to sleeve it anyway, just in case, because you never know. It could be, uh, could be completely crazy and should know who this is. It's good to pull an auto from here, though. Is it guaranteed? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's our auto. One autograph and 12 prisms, so that it was our guarantee auto. I'm going to stick him over here because I don't know if it's worth a lot or not. So we'll, we'll keep that. And we got some colors, Irish Smith. Red wave looking color. Uh, Robin Lopez. All right, guys, we got four packs to go. All right, Tobias Harris. Jaron Jackson. And I am not even going to try to pronounce his name. Not a chance. Then uh, Gogo BDC rookie. I don't know if I've ever seen this guy's card pulled before. It's the first I've seen of it. And I've watched a lot of videos. Opened a lot of this product. I have never seen that name. Robinson, Silver Chandler Parsons, and a Malik Monk. All right, we got to have us a big money card here. Something, something bigger than that Zion. It would take about three Zions to make this box. Three base Zions like that. Terrence Ross, Rudy Gay, Dominance Carl Anthony Towns. And uh, Nikhil Alexander Walker, rookie. Last pack mojo. Here we go. Come on, Silver Zion or Silver Jaw. Please. We've got to have some. Oh, come on. This, this would be the last pack that I opened like that. This might be the last pack of prison I opened all year, so. Got to be something decent. 
All right, we got Charles Barkley. Norman Powell and Jackson Hayes instant impact. So no last pack mojo, but still overall a really good, a really good pack. Um, we'll recap uh, here real quick. So we got a, a base Tyler Hero. I, I can't remember what these are going for right now. Maybe maybe five bucks. So that's still decent. Um, we got the uh, green instant impact Kobe White. We got the silver Sakuda Booya instant impact. We got the silver rookie of uh, Tremont Waters. That's really cool. Then we got this uh, red wave, or I believe that's what they call it, Jordan Poole, which is, I think that's a really good card. I'm not 100% not certain, but I think that's pretty pretty good. Um, and we got our our auto, Dan Issel. I think I pronounced that right. The only thing I hate about autos in Prism is their stickers. I hate Hate, hate, hate sticker autos. It just feels like a cheap, a cheap gimme, if you would. But I mean, other people may feel different than that because it still is an auto, but it just, I don't know, it bothers me. And then the big dog, the one we went hunting for, Zion Williamson, which is really awesome to pull on video. I like capturing that kind of stuff on video. It's really, really neat. Otherwise, decent card, a little eh on the centering, but still, I mean, that could still possibly gem if I'm lucky. So that, that could end up paying for the box once I once I pay that twenty dollar grading fee and ship them. So maybe, but still, I'd rather break even than lose money. And that's that's a fact all day long. All right, guys, this was five tool breaks. So we got some more stuff coming for you later uh, in the the coming weeks. Uh, thanks for watching.